Uh, Aaron Rodgers leaving the Packers would be massive news. It would be massive. Hard not to see it. I mean, it, it feels like there's a chance that's going to happen. Now, it, that is not coming from anybody inside Green Bay or Aaron telling us that or anything like that. But if you think about the short-term rental uh, words that they basically called Will Fuller, who uh, is a speed demon, deep threat. If you don't think that that helps out Aaron in an offense that revolves around passing, uh, what are you talking about for the future of your offense looking like whenever you trade up into the first round and get a guy who's a great athlete, not that Aaron isn't, by the way, but younger, cheaper, could take more shots, is the writing on the wall that Aaron is going to be out of Green Bay sooner than later? I mean, that is something that a lot of people can ask the question, and there's a lot of things that you look or can't you, you look at it, you're like, these particular pieces of evidence here are leading to the thought that Aaron's probably out of Green Bay soon. And if he goes out of Green Bay... Where's he going? The Niners, that'd be wild, huh? Back yeah. to the hometown there. They could have drafted him, though. They chose not to. Has Aaron gotten over that? We could ask him, but that would be a terrible question to ask a person that's in the middle of a season with mm -hmm. another franchise. But I guess there are a lot of fan bases that have thought, oh, Aaron's going to be gone. He, if he was on our team, that would be awesome. And by the way, that's probably uh, 31 franchises mm -hmm. yep. at this point. I've thought about it. Yeah, exactly, yeah. right? Ben Roethlisberger, who knows how much longer he's going to play. He's old, man. Imagine Aaron Rodgers in Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh Steelers fans with Aaron Rodgers. Oh, my mm. God. That defense that they have over there. Oh, my God. He's already with the Steelers of the NFC, so you might as well come over and do that. I mean, it, by the way, a lot of similarities mm -hmm. there. A mm -hmm. lot of similarities. I would say that Steelers fans, by the way, Aaron, will be a lot more uh, ruthless and, and rude to the people who oppose you. Like, <laughs> all these media people, you know, that have been going after you for a long time. Uh -huh. I do believe if you were on the Steelers, those Yinzers would not stand for that shit. Mm -hmm. I believe there would be a loud voices. But the Green Bay Packers like one of the most professional organizations of all time so it'd be very interesting to hear where he went Niners obviously a possibility Ooh. I mean there's a couple teams that you think like they would immediately try to do whatever they could to get him in their uniform and he's already said he wants to play till he's at least 40s 36 right now I mean you look at the Packers aren't going to re-sign him probably I mean I don't know when they started talking about Brady in terms of him like losing it I guess they did that with Rodgers last year but like if you watch the games it's like, I mean he's still got as much fucking zip on it as he ever has he I mean he he, he may play till he's 50. I think we talked to I don't know if it was draft night or just one of the quarantine days there where we talked to him and uh, I said hey you're seeing Tom Brady get 25 million a year at 45 years old or something like that. Drew Brees, he, he's obviously uh, older than you. He's getting 25 million a year. Philip Rivers is, is is older than you. He's getting 25 million. Do you look at that and you just go like, man, I'm gonna be able to just make at least 25, 30 million dollars for I don't know another 10 years at you're 36 years old? And he was like, yeah, you obviously have to look around. <laughs> like, obviously, you have to see that, and he takes care of his body better than he ever had. I mean, there is. No reason not to think that, especially with how athletic he still is, that he can't play for another eight years if he really wanted. Like, it's a, a, whether or not he would want to at this point. And you see what he said on the show on Tuesday in terms of, like, tell how competitive he is. Yeah, like, com that competitive. Like, that's not going anywhere. Like, it'll be, I think, if he were to retire early, I think that's something that's probably pretty difficult to replace, like, right after you're done playing.